show for y'all. Got a damn good show. Joe Rogan's had enough. He's tired of being labeled a Republican, a conservative. Check him out. There's a bunch of shit that keeps you from being yeah. a Republican. Yeah. But that's one of the, like, people will say, like, oh, you know, you're a secret conservative. I'm like, you could suck b I don't know what the f you're talking about. <laughs> I'm so far away from being a Republican. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just because I believe in the Second Amendment and just because I support the military and just because yeah. I support police. Yeah. Like, I was on welfare as a kid. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think yeah. it's important. I yeah. think so, having a social safety net is it's great. crucial. Yes. It's crucial. Yeah. Yeah. We should help each other. We're yeah. supposed to be one big community. I hate to break it to you. If you are for the military, you support police, and uh, you're for the Second Amendment, yeah, that makes you a Republican. There's yeah. no such thing as a Democrat who supports those three things. Yeah. And on top of that, you against men competing against women in sports. Yeah. You ain't a big fan of them transgenders from what I saw. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, you're probably a fan of transgenders just like we are, right? We're fans of transgenders, but they're asking for too much. <laughs> You know, when they say trans rights are human rights, they no, what they really mean is trans rights. We want to rule the world. We want to do anything and everything. Yeah, so what what he's pretty much saying is he's the uh, liberal. Yeah. That's what I was most of my life. Yeah. Until uh <laughs> they went batshit crazy over there. So the left did this. The Democrats, they went far left. Yeah. And just left people right here. Yeah. And you just like us. We was like <laughs> Yeah. I looked at us like, what a nigga. <laughs> y'all come back man y'all quit playing y'all left us over here with you <laughs> come on back this ain't funny no more no you niggas are serious yeah hey man how y'all doing hey uh can we join y'all's little 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 part over there you're <laughs> <are> welcome <laughs> 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 oh man, that wasn't funny. We shouldn't laugh at that. That's what it felt like, though. I mean, we changed up. Uh, we start doing politics. Mm -hmm. We start going on the road doing shows. I mean, we was in Nashville, Tennessee. Yeah. And uh, looked out the one I said. I looked out. It was like the curtain. You could look yeah. out and see your fans. I looked out. There, I was like. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're in the wrong venue. <laughs> is this is the right place. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, our fans changed overnight, man. Mm -hmm. But I tell you what, man, as long as we've been on YouTube and when we decide to come out and share our politics with people, man, mm -hmm. the love we get from conservatives, man, is higher than it ain't that, any love I've ever gotten on YouTube. Ain't that bad, Joe? I mean, you're so you, Joe's a moderate. I'm yeah, sure he's you, a moderate. You a true liberal, which makes you vote Republican. Yeah, There's no way in hell, Joe, you're going to tell me you voting for Joe Biden. <laughs> hey, I, I support the Second Amendment. Yeah. I support the police, the military. I hate them damn transgenders. <laughs> he didn't say that. But I'm going to go over here and vote for... Huh? I'm not, I'm not as big as... I mean, you're embellishing on it. You exaggerate. Yeah. He doesn't, he doesn't appreciate men yeah. competing against females. Yeah, that's what he I, doesn't hate transgenders. Yeah, that's what we I'm don't saying. hate transgenders. I don't do hate transgenders. No, I love transgenders. <laughs> Trust me, I do. <laughs> I'm just, what I'm just saying is you disagree with that. But you you agree with all that, but you're going to walk and go vote for a Democrat? They created all that shit. Yeah. <laughs> they, they hijacked the term gender, male, female. They hijacked and transformed into something crazy. They saying trans women are women? They said people, humans, we're transformers. I know you don't agree with that. He touched on, he alluded to that um, Republicans safety are trying net. to take away safety nets. Well, I think that's what he was implying. And then yeah. I've seen some posts about Republicans trying to cut. I don't think um, there's any truth to that, though. I haven't seen anything. Most of the white, most people that's on welfare are white. Yeah, that's true. So, yeah. but I'll say it's this. A, it's a one, misconception about that. They think they're trying to take away uh, welfare because the, a lot of people think a majority of people on welfare are blacks, which is not true. It's whites. There's yeah. more poor white people on welfare than it makes sense because 70% yeah. of the country is white. So what I'm saying is, what I will say about Democrats, what I don't like about them is that they create this framework, this infrastructure that makes uh, the citizens of the country dependent on the government. Yeah, We should have safety nets for like rare occasions when something goes bad in your life and yeah. the government comes in and helps you out. Right. But people take advantage of it and live off of it. Yeah, And Democrats use that for to keep these people poor and to keep voting for them. Yeah. People on welfare, they're making a career out of it. I don't think you should have that opportunity to take advantage of that social 
uh, network. I yeah. think you should be on it. You have a time frame, like unemployment, you can be on it with like eight months to a year. You, you get a time frame. You shouldn't be able to live on welfare for the rest of your life. You shouldn't be dependent on the government. Unless, that, what, that is the biggest threat to unless, our democracy. Shut up. That's the biggest threat to democracy. I'm getting excited. Calm down. Stop cutting me off. Won't you calm down? You're screaming at I, me, buddy. I, I, I'm trying to rough my words out. Look, the biggest threat to our democracy is Democrats trying to buy people's votes with reparations, extra yeah. benefits, money. That's that's the biggest threat to our democracy, and they're doing it, not the Republicans. Hey, look, hey, Joe, they just tried to, they are uh, up in uh, black Democrats. They just fourteen trillion dollars to try to give black people for reparations. I count, I, I figured it up. It's three hundred eleven thousand dollars. Hold each, up now for each black. Three hundred eleven thousand dollars. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, bro. We get that. We get. Three hundred eleven thousand. That's six hundred twenty-two thousand between us. Man, man, these Democrats, man, they coming through. <laughs> Damn good show, Joe. Hey, man, I'm voting left this next election. <laughs> you crazy as hell. I and it, yeah, reparation three hundred eleven thousand dollars. That's chump change. Man, they coming through, man. That's chump change when you want you really think about it. These people mm -hmm. that's broke, they get three hundred eleven thousand. That, that money is gone in two hours. <laughs> Hey, we're giving away a truck. Yeah. Go to our website, buy anything, and you're automatically in it to win. What? A 2023 mm -hmm. Chevy High Country HD High Definition truck mm -hmm. with a Duramax transmission <laughs> in it. Yeah, we don't need that damn reparations. We got money. <laughs> That's who the Democrats appeal to. Broke-ass people. Yeah. Buying votes.